rotary kiln is lined inside with high alumina refractory to protect the kiln shell when operated at high temperatures. Conventionally, high alumina low cement castable is used in the kiln hot zones. The total heat input for a typical DRI plant is 24,537 megajoules out of which radiation losses from the surface of the rotary kiln are found to be 8 to 10 percent. The major causes of energy losses in case of conventional refractory system are damages during accretion removal, gradual increase in shell temperature leading to energy loss, higher shell temperature due to high thermal conductivity leading to radiation loss. The energy efficient replacement for high alumina low cement castables are malite based high alumina castables. The thermal conductivity of the castable with fused alumina base is high. The malite based high alumina castable helps the shell temperature to drop by about 50 to 80 degrees Celsius, thereby reducing radiation heat loss through the kiln shell. Thus, using malite-based castables in place of low cement castables can lead to a saving of 14% in the skin temperature and around 30% savings in radiation heat loss from surface. Other benefits include easy accretion removal, less damages to lining, high abrasion resistance, very good hot modulus of rupture, low ferric oxide improved behaviors under reducing conditions. The above replacement of refractories can be done during scheduled overhauling of plant. The technology is applicable in all capacities of plant. Malite based refractory typically costs 45,000 rupees per metric ton. For a 100 TPD DRI plant, 180 metric tons of malite based refractory is required, which works out to be 81 lakh rupees per metric ton. Let us consider the case of a typical 100 TPD DRI unit operating for 7,200 hours per year. The total wall area is 396 meters square. The replacement of conventional refractory with malite-based refractory can lead to a saving of 540 tons of coal per year. Thus, an investment of 81 lakh rupees can be recouped within a period of three years with a monetary saving of 27 lakh rupees per year. The installations can save 12.65 terajoules of energy annually, leading to GHG emission saving of 1196 tons of carbon dioxide per year. Refractory linings should be regularly monitored and undergo periodic maintenance. Accruals should be removed at regular intervals. Higher skin losses should be monitored and addressed immediately.